I'm Eric with Platinum Products and today we're going to be talking about our beach cart with receiver arm and wheelies wheels. Uh, you have everything here that you receive with the purchase of our beach cart. You have the handle, the foot, the receiver arm, axles, the axle, the quick connects, and your wheelies wheels. Uh, today we'll be talking about uh, the assembly of this beach cart. Some people have uh, had some questions, uh, particular customers having uh, maybe some problems with the assembly part of it, so we just want to clarify a few things so it's easier for you once you obtain it and you'll have no problems. So we have the beach cart itself. Uh, we'll talk about the assembly of the axle and the wheelies first. So what I'll do is I'll take our beach cart, I'll put it on the side here, and if you do this at home, Make sure to be careful of the surface that's underneath that. You don't want to scratch up the beach car. We've got a nice tablecloth. We'll take our axle and our wheelies wheels. Here's where most of the confusion comes from. Uh, we have the axle, we have the wheelies, and uh, some people have had some problems before. What you want to do is take your axle, put it in your wheelies, and push it until you hear that snap. If you don't hear that snap, and if you pull on it, if it comes off, it's going to come off once you put it on the beach cart. So that's going to make it quite difficult. Uh, if, if you don't hear the snap when you push it in, and if it comes out, you'll take this part right here, uh, it's spring-loaded, and you'll turn it counterclockwise about a quarter turn, and you'll take it out. That's how you would uh, completely take the axle out. But if you don't hear it snap in, turn it, push it in, and again, let it go, pull on it. If it doesn't move, you're fine. Take your axle, push it through these axle mounts, all the way through. You'll take your other wheelies, take it to the other side. Nice firm grip on your axle. Push it in until you hear that lock. And again, if you can pull on it, if it comes off, try to do it again. Try to turn that spring-loaded piece but if you push those apart and they don't come off, you're fine. That's exactly how the way it's supposed to go. We'll turn it onto the side here. And the next thing we'll do is our foot. We'll take our foot piece and we'll take our first quick connect piece. Both pieces. Take this, push this onto the bottom. And we'll take our first piece. There's a couple of different holes here and this is completely adjustable. You've got a couple of different mounts You want to line it up completely with the mount here. It takes perfect alignment. Push it through both holes. Take your pin, push that through. You'll take your handle next. Push your handle in. Now this is pretty important as well. If you're using your beach cart, you'll push your handle in and you'll uh, have your handle outwards so you can use it when you're done with it, take your handle, turn it around, and that's the easiest way to store it. Uh, and we'll get to why that's important. So you'll push this through, take your second of the pins, push that one through as well, line everything up, push that through, take your pin, push that through that hole, and that's assembled. Now, We'll take your receiver arm, this is the last piece. What we'll do is we will move this so again, you can see what we're doing. Take your receiver arm. Now you can see these are adjustable as well, whether you're going to line it up perfectly with all four holes, using three of the holes, you can adjust it the way you need to. This will go into your hitch, whether it's on your truck or your car. That particularly doesn't matter. We're just going to use the top hole, just for demonstration purposes. You'll line everything up here. Make sure that's all lined up. Push that one through. Make sure that both holes are pushed through. Take your bottom pin. Push that one through as well. Take your second pin, push that one, and last piece as well. Now we talked about our handle that's up top here. For storage, you'll wanna turn that around just so when you're moving with your vehicle, uh, it's not sticking out 
You're not going to hit anybody or anything. Everything is packed away very nicely. And these will line up onto your hitch with the receiver mount. But that's really it. That's exactly how this is supposed to be assembled and used. And if you do everything correctly, you won't have any problems at all.